analysts whatsoever. Now it's based on reputation management, but what we've created with this particular plugin is essentially a brand new service offliners can go and sell to clients um, that takes the reputation management spin, but it isn't about going and cleaning up bad reviews. This is something completely different and something that isn't being offered right now. So the uh, plugin is called Review Buffer, and Review Buffer is basically a, a review buffer that businesses can use to stop bad reviews appearing online and they can also use it to prompt good reviews um, to appear online as well. So what happens is you install the uh, plugin on any WordPress install and if you want a review copy of this to check out or do any demo videos or anything like that, let either of us know, we'll fire that over. So you install it on your um, WordPress install you configure it, um, configure it to how you want uh, it actually to display. We can see it here, um, and you choose the page you would like to overlay. So it will overlay any page, and if it's a responsive theme, it is responsive. Everything's mobile friendly as well. So basically, how it works is, say for example, this was on Bronco Steakhouse website, so broncosteakhouse.com. They would overlay the page broncosteakhouse.com forward slash review, and basically they would promote that URL in their restaurant. You know, um, how was your meal? Come and leave us a review here. Now, what happens is, if um, their customers have had a bad experience, or if their customers have had a great experience, we're prompting them to go to this URL. But what happens is they hit this holding page here, and I'll show you an example as I'm doing this. So they go to the URL, broncosteakhouse.com forward slash review, and we've already pre-set up this page. And what this page does, this pre asks them the question if they enjoyed their meal. If they didn't, we can stop that review going online. If they did enjoy um, their meal, we can prompt them to go and leave a review where we want them to leave a review. So it's an entire service here, an entire strategy. Now, if they, um, they visit this URL, thanks for visiting um, Broncos, how was your meal? Well, all of this is editable uh, here, so you can put whatever logo for any business. Again, edit the message, edit the button, so it's multilingual, all of that. So if they did not enjoy their meal, usually they would be on Facebook, they would be on TripAdvisor, they would be on Yelp, Google+, Twitter, basically berating this business and saying how bad their meal and experience was. So what we do is we create a plugin that stops that from happening because when they tap on their phone, not so great, and they click that button, rather than put them towards a review site or giving them any other option to go and do that, we hit them with a contact form. And this contact form is, we're sorry you didn't enjoy your meal. Please let us know what the problem was and we'll be in touch. They can now complain directly to the manager of Bronco Steakhouse right now about what the problem was. And we've stopped that review, that complaint going online. So that's how powerful this is. So it's an entire service. There's nothing like this out there. Now, if they decide instead that the meal was great and I want to leave you a glowing review, what we can then do is hit them, great, we'd appreciate if you could share your experience with others. And we link up Facebook and Twitter here for this particular business. Now you can also link in any other social networks you want. And the business in this case can choose where they want reviews. So if they want all their reviews on TripAdvisor, they could leave all the other review sites off and just have a, a TripAdvisor link here. So again, they can control where the great reviews are left online. So as the name states, this is a review buffer. This is something businesses can put in front of their customers while they're in their, their place of business, while they're in sat down having a meal in a restaurant, for example, and stop them going and leaving bad reviews online. They're intercepting those, but again, promoting the great reviews as well and actually showing people where they want to go and leave these reviews. So that's what Review Buffer is. Now this particular launch here, um, all that that you've just seen by the way is fully editable for any business you want to work with. Now what you basically get here, what we're doing on the front end here guys is we're going to include this plugin um, as you've just seen it there. We're going to have two licenses, we're going to have a single site license and we're also going to have a developer's license which is the one where you can sell to as many clients as you want. So everybody's going to want to pick that one up. The plugin is fully multilingual so again all elements you saw there, all text elements, everything is, is uh, editable. It's easy to install and use and um, give us a shout if you want a review copy. We've got tutorials on using it and setting it up for your clients and we're also offering free lifetime updates on that as well. Now the OTO on this, the upsell, is we've, we've actually, um, while working with clients, we built up um, a dossier of loads of different graphics we use where we use these graphics in businesses such as hotels and um, such as restaurants where we prompt them to go and give feedback um, and again um, these are all table tents and flyers so this is the OTO so we we're actually going to be giving a graphical pack of flyers and table tents 
that again, those that want to use this plugin to sell to local businesses can go in and actually provide them with graphics and table tents um, for um, the review buffer plugin and, the, and, the, and what they set up for the business. So again, all of this is interchangeable. You get all the PSDs, um, and again, we've targeted all the major um, the major niches.